Hello everyone, hope you're having a good time and for today's lesson we we're going to talk about the ecological system. What is it? That's what we need to find out. So let's start. Yuri Braun van Brenner is an American psychologist who is the founder of ecological system theory. So what is it? It examines individuals' relationships within the communities and the wider society. This theory looks at a child's development within the context of the system of relationships that form his or her environment. In short, these layers of environment has an effect on a child's development. Now that we know the definition of ecological system, let us now proceed to the layers or the environments that composes it. Ecological theory has a total layer of six. We have the child, microsystem, mesosystem, exosystem, macrosystem, and chronosystem. The main concern of this theory is the child at the center. It represents you, me, and every one of us that possesses age, gender, skills, knowledge, and personal characteristics which says affected by the following layers or environment. Next to it is microsystem. This involves the persons who are near you or the child. It can be your parents, friends, teachers, neighbors, or anyone who can easily communicate with you. So there's a big possibility for you to be influenced by them on your attitude or your behavior. Mesosystem is the relationships between the microsystems. For example, home and school, family and friends. In some instances, if the parent likes the child's friends, it will cause the child to be happy or comfortable with his surroundings. As what we've said, it is the relationships between the person in microsystems, the mother, and the child's friend. Exosystem, relationships that may exist between two or more settings, one of which may not contain the developing child but affects him indirectly nonetheless. For example, these organization first affect the person inside the microsystem because there they were involved and the person in the micro will surely affect the child as it goes. Macro system. This is the largest system that contains people and places that affect the child significantly. In this system, it involves norms, culture, value that the community follows as well as the exo, meso, and micro to child. Chrono system. For the last layer, it involves the happenings of someone related to child that contributes big impact to his or her life. The best example are that of the child's loved one or divorce of the child's parents. This will cause him change in his attitude or behavior as he grow up. To summarize it all, ecological theory just presents that the environment surrounding the child contribute a lot in building their character or as a person growing up. Alright, and that is Ecological System. Did you learn something? Well, I hope so. See you on our next session. Goodbye!